So now we can publish drafts or we can create drafts, but we want to be able to now publish them to the, the final form. And so we're going to create a, a publish draft button. So I know that I'll need to import React and button from Ant Design. It's going to take in the props of an ID. So we're going to pass in the ID of the, the item that we want to publish. So we're, we're going to first return the publish mutation component. And so again, this is being pulled from the auto-generated Apollo components. Our mutation will be called publish draft. And then we're going to have a button that will have an on click handler. And so on click, it will just publish the draft. And then the variables here will just be the ID that we pass into this React component. And then we're gonna have a, a refetch query for both the published and unpublished feed. So that both lists will update. Now we need to export it. And so now we want to be able to, to use this publish button on our feed list. And so in the render section, uh, we have to take the second parameter, which will have the ID. And so this is getting it from the, the list that we are building up and in, in, up above. And so we have to say, Okay, if published is true, don't do anything, but otherwise sh show the published draft button and pass in uh, the ID parameter. And we're using button group here, which is another ant design thing. So now we can import the, the published draft component at the top. And so now we can try it out. So here's an entry that I had before. If I click the publish button, we can see that it went from the hidden feed to the normal feed. And so our mutation is now working.